Um, we've been together probably, well we've had Dom the drummer for a year now and had Sam the singer for two years but me and Jack have kind of grown up um, playing guitars together and stuff so work out for yourself. Um, we're probably kind of, the best way to put it is indie, ska, rock with a little bit of folk in it. So it's quite difficult to narrow it down. Yeah, we're some of us are still in college working, and um, it's pretty hard sometimes with um, loads of gigs to do and stuff. So you're trying to, well, not exactly skiving off, but it's difficult sometimes. But we'll give it up for the band anyway because we really enjoy what we do. I first started playing drums. That was when I was about 12, and then gave it up really quickly and went on to bass, which. And much prefer. Um, not really, it's not really a girly instrument, but um, I just think there's not enough girl bass guitarists out there, so why not really? It's a good instrument, so. I mean, there's quite big age gaps between us. I mean, one of us is 16 and then the eldest is 21, so, but we all get along really well, like best friends sort of thing, so it works quite well. You know, we can all be immature at some point, so then we can all, you know, we all get our head on the straight when we have to like go to interviews and stuff we're normally quite good with stuff like that so yeah um i have just finished a foundation course doing graphics and that's just for one year so um, i'm really into my art as well so we've played moles quite a lot and we played it four times in one week once yeah was it three um it sort of happens you come up with a few chords you know like a chorus or like a verse and then we all get together and we sort of construct the songs together and about it. Yeah. Uh, lyrics I write. I write the lyrics. Well, a lot of my lyrics come from sort of my personal experiences and experiences that I have, you know, with people and sort of um, things that are quite sort of close to me. It's not I don't sort of sing about like nights out and things like that. And I'm not really inspired by that sort of thing. I'm inspired by people and sort of what they do to me and sort of relationships. Yeah. I live in work at home with my dad um, and I've got a stepmom and me and my dad are frame picture frame restorers and I'm a gilder and that's what I do. Um, not really, I believe I, I'm a strong believer in things fall into place if you you know sort of have a positive attitude so if I have a family later on I think it will come at the right time and hopefully anyway. So but I like challenges so if it is a challenge then I'll take it on. <laughs> It's, it's sort of in flux at the moment, isn't it? You know, you do, the music industry, you, do, you don't know. Um, I think you can make it a, a long way and get noticed these days by yourself and off your own back, which, you know, I quite like the idea of. And instead of sort of hoping, you know, praying for that sort of record deal to boost you up. And because we're a young band as well, I think we've got a lot of learning to do. And um, I just want to get, you know, better and better. I just want to play more and more before, you know, anything sort of. If anything sort of big happened, I'd rather sort of get a load of gigs under a belt and, and do it that way. Um, I saw my cousin playing drums. I was about 14 years old, and I saw my cousin playing drums and thought, yeah, that's cool. Um, and I sort of, for about six months, tapped on my legs and then thought, right, I'll do it. I'll go and I'll have a drum lesson. And then I bought a drum kit, and then it all picked up. And then I met these guys. <laughs> we've done a few, we've done um, a CD. Oh, they were selling it at the moment. Uh, it's not really properly released, but we're just selling it, um, you know, at gigs, just as uh, as people want it. If they like it, they can come and buy a CD. But it's um, it's not being, you know, done professionally by a record company in any big recording studio. It's recorded in someone's front room. But uh, it's really, really good uh, quality, actually. A very talented guy. We are www.myspace.com slash the vault. <laughs> I had to plug it. Um, and we, we've um, we've been really working on it. Oh, I've been working on it a lot, trying to make sure we get back to everybody and stuff like that because it's been pretty crazy at the moment. We've been getting lots of hits. It's been great. <laughs> 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 oh dear. No, no, not at all. No, I, I wasn't. I wasn't sure I was surprised. I've seen it. I've seen a lot of it before. I think um, there's been a few bands around lately where there's been girls playing bass. It seems to be the cool thing to do at the moment. 
on a yeah, Glastonbury's coming up. It's going to be it's going to be massive. Hopefully, we've got um, on a certain a certain social networking site. We've got nearly a hundred confirmed guests, and that's just people that are on the internet looking looking us up. Plus, it's going to be on a Thursday night at ten o'clock. There's going to be no well, hardly any other music on. Everyone's going to be a bit woozy, wanting a bit of a dance. So it should be a really really good gig. Really got big plans for it. Two years time. I think by that point, hopefully, we'll have decided whether or not we're going to wait for some sort of label to pick us up, or we're going to go, you know, the whole whole by ourselves and do it all ourselves. There's a lot of DIY bands at the moment doing it all themselves and, and doing really well out of it. I hope in two years we'll sort of make a decision whether or not we've waited around enough, or what, you know, hopefully we've progressed enough by then to have got one or the other. Um, well, we've won this MTV competition, Gets In, Get Heard, and. Uh we entered in for it about it was last October, and it was just it was really good fun. Actually. It's just it's just been an amazing experience to see it. going up to the studios and doing everything. It's just fantastic, and winning it is the best thing. Really good. No, lo loads and loads of bands went in, and come we got shortlisted to twenty four bands, then we shortlisted to f ten, then five, then three, and then we've won it. And it's just it's good. It has actually, yeah. It's um, our fan base has seemed to be growing. You know, kind of more exposure to our music and everything. We're getting, we're getting last week about 600 plays a day, you know, which is pretty good for you know, when we were getting about 80 before. And so it's really good. You know, it's helped us out quite a lot already. Oh, our fan base is quite varied because we've got quite a lot of young people and quite a lot of you know, kind of changes between about 15 to about 40, which is quite nice. And people went in, into all different types of music. Like I, I remember we got a message from some girl who like screamo music and somehow for some reason liked us, which is quite nice, <laughs> it was alright, yeah, yeah, it's, we've got quite vast, vast fan base. No, we, d we do try and give off a lot of energy when we play and I, I, I think that comes out anyways, you know, we, we work really hard on our performances because that's, that's what we, you know, live for really, it's the reason we're all doing this, is for our live stuff, it's where we can really kind of show everyone what we're made of. I mean, we do quite a few gigs up in London, but it's, it's, it's a lot harder out there to try and get the kind of a momentum going as it is here. I mean, it's still pretty damn hard around here, but there, it's just it's another nut to crack, really, isn't it? It's, just, it's, it's kind of nice, though, now, because it's kind of, we kind of, people around here have heard of us a lot more than they used to. I don't know. We all get on too well. It's just, we just all get on really well. We're all best friends. You know, it's just it's it's good. It's not just like, I know so so many bands who are just you know purely bandmates. They don't hang out with each other. We're all you know go to the pub or whatever. We're just you know, we're all really good friends. So it's, it's kind of it makes us write better songs. I think <laughs> you know working all together. It's good. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.